What you doing? You do that all the time for. Go sit down on the bench. I don't want to see you right now. Okay, can do that. Or come up. It comes up. Yes. Okay, and, you know, we work on our shooting a little bit more in practice and we'll be able to shoot the right way if we practice like that all the time. And then go for the job. Well, what's going to work better? The coach going to, when the player leaves the rink, is he going to be, oh, okay, maybe the coach told me, Mom, I try something else. Or is he going to leave the rink like this, kick this, he don't even want to come back. He don't even want to play anymore. So, here, everything I do, I have to point to here all the time. So, as a coach, you got to nurture and you got to build, to develop. It's like, like your own child. It's, it's the love of the game. It's why I do it. You know, when I'm growing up, I wasn't a good hockey player, but I grew up in a different time. I grew up in the 70s, so the game was different. It was not so much about skill development, it was like that kind of development. So I could make it to the NHL. I became a good player at maybe 14, 15, when I became stronger. Then I started taking skating courses, and then 17, 18, 19, I played. Uh, junior hockey, and we win the Memorial Cup Championship of Canada. Uh, but a lot of people helped me along the way. And I, I always want to get into trouble. I'm not the model, the model player growing up. So there's, there's lots of things that can happen. So self-esteem, very important. Uh, so Junior就是二十岁以下的全国冠军，所以呃，他在这个过程中也是啊遇到蛮多的挑战，但是因为他的教练一直给他鼓励，所以让他继续打下。